perfect what should I do here good morning everyone there in the studio I got this problem that I always find the perfect woman well sort of perfect to be with me I'm a tall dark and very handsome young man trying to make it in life but right now I don't feel that way because I thought part of being a man is to treat your woman like you would care for your mother I'm nice to her but she says she doesn't like me being nice to her all the time at times she wants me to hit her wow. because every time we argue I walk away and just ask why 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 darn it why say damn it say damn it say damn it okay well you can say that I would never even think of put I would never even think of putting a hand on a woman what should I do should I stay I really do love her or should I go please help sign damn. dang ladies damn I'm a good man Okay, dear good man, this is a little letter, big issues. You say you're tall, you're dark, you're very handsome and trying to make it in life with a sort of perfect woman for you. Let me just tell you that a woman who's perfect for you will have your back, she'll have similar goals and interests, she'll have, you know, similar aspirations that you have. She'll be with you, she'll be loving you, she'll be supporting you as you make your way, as you say, in life. A woman who thinks you're too nice and wants you to hit her is crazy. Okay, this woman, she's drama-filled. You want to stay away from that. This woman is not a good match for you. Please know that no real woman wants her man to hit her. Uh, you know, the best thing to me about this whole letter is that you've had the good sense to walk away when the arguments, you know, get heated and not put your hands on her. As far as a, a man treating his woman uh, like his mom, I say not exactly. You know, of course you want to respect your woman and all of that, but the way you love your woman is going to be different from the way you love your uh, mom. But yes, by all means, treat her well. You know, be a good man to her. You say you really do love her. Should you stay or should you go? I don't think you should stay. I just, I, I just really don't. You, you, you guys are not right for each other. You say you're a good man. You need a good woman by your side, not one that's drama filled and wants you to hit her, you know, and all that stuff. She's trouble. She's just trouble, and and, and means you no good. Steve. Well, uh, this is a hard one here because it, it doesn't make no sense. It is a hard. Do you need to read really? it again and read it like they got it wrote? Well, let me see. Good morning, everyone here in the studio. I got this problem that I always find a perfect woman, well, sort of perfect to be with me. I'm a tall, dark, and very handsome young man right there, trying to make it in life. But right now, I don't feel that way, because I thought part of being a man is to treat your woman like you would care for your mother. I'm nice to her, but she said she don't like me being nice to her all the time. She want me to help her. <laughs> because every time we yeah, all like that. I walk away, I just, why, 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 <laughs> Lord, damn it, why? I could never even think of putting my hand on a woman. What should I do? <laughs> should I stay? I really do love her. Or should I go? Please help sign. Damn, ladies, I'm a good man. <laughs> uh, this letter is full of bull crap right here. Let me read through this for y'all right here. I'm going to tell y'all something about men. This ain't how men write. So let's just understand. There's a lot of shaking that's in here. First of all, he ain't all he say he is. <laughs> Anytime you see a man that describes himself, I'm a tall, dark, and very handsome young man. How you know? <laughs> Every time you just spend the mirror looking, telling yourself, ooh, I'm a very tall, dark, very handsome young man. <laughs> so how you know? Very, very Trying attractive. to make it in life. That means he, he ain't nowhere yet. But he tall, dark, and handsome, which is what he really riding on. <laughs> But right now, I don't feel that way. I don't, oh, now you don't feel pretty. <laughs> he said handsome. No, no, but see, right now, I don't feel that way. He don't feel pretty today. <laughs> when I come back, I'm going to break this Take brother it down. Because I'm going to tell y'all something. I read a letter totally different, man. And all the real men out there know good and well, this ain't how men write. Come on. So already, you shaky, player. And we just gonna go and get to the bottom of this right here. Oh, man. It, it, Say he tall, dog, young, and handsome. And very, very handsome. handsome. <laughs> very handsome. That's the outstanding part. I knew you were gonna love that line. <laughs> That's got more emphasis on it than the hidden part. Okay. You're listening to the Steve Harvey. I a couple of times while we was on break. I see it now. 
You know, I'm a tall, dark, and very handsome young man trying to make it in life, but right now I don't feel that way. <laughs> <laughs> because I thought like that. part of being a man is to treat your woman like you would care for your mother. Well, that's an exact true statement, Shirley, I have to tell you. Because what he said was correct. I thought part of being a man is to treat your woman like you would care for your mother. That's the treatment of his mm -hmm. woman. It's right. similar to the treatment of his mother, not the love. So in that, he's absolutely correct. Then, dot, 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 I'm nice to her, but she says she doesn't like me being nice to her all the time. At times, she wants me to hit her because every time we argue, I walk away and just ask. Then it's in capital letters, why, 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 why? damn it, why? It's dramatic. It sounds like your ass is crying a lot. It sounds to me like he's a whiny type little dude. You know, um... How old you think that boy is? He got to be young, man. Twenties. He got to be. If he ain't, this letter is in far worse yeah. condition than it should I'd be. I'd letter him. Right. <laughs> but if he's in his thirties, this is really... We're getting close to catastrophe here. I'd say twenties. I would never even think of putting my hand on a woman. What should I do? I sh should I stay? I really do love her. Or should I go? Please sign. Damn, ladies. <laughs> I'm a good man. Well, brother, Good boy. let's let's not be so quick. <laughs> Maybe some other areas in manhood you lack it. Like number one, I think you full of yourself. Okay. And I think this letter has a lot of holes in it. Mm. You such a perfect man and you love her so much. What is y'all arguing about all the time? And then why you always do the perfect thing? You walk away and you ask yourself, why, why? Why? Damn it. Why? That's because you a drama major. I think your ass is heavily involved in Shakespeare or some other type of acting okay, okay, course. Okay, wait a minute. Yeah, I really do. I think he's a drama guy. I just think he's full of drama. What time are you drama to, dog? <laughs> you know, y'all in there arguing about mirror time at the house because you're so very tall and so very handsome. <laughs> she might be cute, too. And then at the end, sign, damn, ladies, I'm a good man. So you want everybody to know Surely. two things in this letter. <laughs> that you don't hit women. Well, a few things you want them to know. You, you don't hit women. You want them to know that. You want them to know that you're tall, dark, and very handsome. And you want them to know that, damn, you a good man. <laughs> well, are you really tall? <laughs> or are you 5'7"? And a half. <laughs> Do you have little hands? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Damn, ladies, I'm a good man. Mm -hmm. One thing I know about being a real good man, somebody daughter gonna want you. Gonna want you. Mm -hmm. Soon as somebody through with you, somebody gonna want you back. <laughs> but you can't seem to hold it together. So let's really start evaluating a couple of things here. First of all, I don't think you're tall. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think you're five seven. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you're dark at all. I think you're high yellow. You like skin, dog? <laughs> I think you're five seven high. Yeah, lies. Mr. Let me put right lies. here, right here, and then, and very, very handsome. I think he's a little ugly ass little boy. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's a little troll doll looking little son. I think he's walking around troll. and scaring people off. <laughs> You know, I, I don't know what did happen at the house. You know, did she borrow your brush? Is that what y'all are getting about? What? Did you, did you tell her to stop and point it at her with one of them little bitty hands? <laughs> Was you standing on the steps talking to stop her? Stop it right now. Trying to appear tall. Stop it right now. I know my answer appears ridiculous, but ridiculous letters require ridiculous responses. <laughs> so let's just go on. So why, 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 why? I think it's time for a poem. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Here Let's I go. am, so dark and lovely and tall am I, trying to figure out the single question why mm. I ask myself in all my beauty. Mm -hmm. Does anybody think I'm tall? Anybody but me? Mm. Some people say I'm tall, I'm only 5'7". 
when I'm with my woman, I swear she feels like she's in heaven. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh. But I wear her, I treat her, I treat her just like my mother. But she says, hold on, little boy. I want to feel like another. Okay. Uh -huh. Maybe I want to feel Ooh. like I'm your lover. <laughs> what I'm asking you to hit me is really to spank me. Oh. <laughs> but you don't see it because you're so busy trying to be, have me like your mother would be. I want to be like your girl would be. Spank me, Big Daddy. Mm. Spank me. <laughs> I'll Keep call you Big Daddy house. even though you small. Uh -huh. I'll call you Big Daddy even though you ain't tall. Uh oh. You only 5'7. I'm the doorstep to heaven. <laughs> but I look at you. Are you my man? I can't tell because you got small hands. <laughs> You're listening to the Steve Harvey Show.